How you doing? This is Ivan with Bite Size Wisdom for Busy People. And I'm back with another quote of the day to have a great day. Today, our quote is by Saadi Shirazi. The quote is, Have patience. All things are difficult before they become easy. In a world that seems to be exponentially moving faster, developing real patience will help us to navigate life much more intelligently. So how can we develop real patience? Real patience can be a byproduct of our sincere self-development work, work like our meditation practices and our active self-observation. On my channel, you always hear me talking about learning to objectively observe ourselves, where the goal is simply learning to observe and witness the contents of the mind in a more objective manner. This entails learning not to react to our unconscious tendencies. Check out the link in the description if you want a more thorough description on what I mean by self-observation. In learning not to react, we will be developing real patience with ourselves and the world. Every moment, most people are compelled to act according to their unobserved thoughts, feelings, and sensations. With so many contradicting energies within us, it's easy to see why so many of us are extremely impatient. As you learn to use your attention to separate yourself from yourself by setting up a passively alert observer on one side and that which it observes on the other, this being our thoughts, feelings, and bodily sensations, you will be developing the greatest patience. You will realize that every moment is an opportunity to watch and to try to not react according to an unobserved and unquestioned tendency. Most people are completely fused to the objects that come across their attention, both inner and outer objects. Their awareness isn't free as it is completely identified to the objects so they are not able to observe in a simple, clear manner. Initially, it will be very difficult and your observations can easily just turn into an intellectual exercise if you don't have the proper understanding of all the subtle dynamics of your attention, of your psyche. And it's essential to be able to ground our attention in the sensations of the body as we observe. But if you persist and have patience with yourself, you will learn to get a distinct inner taste of doing proper self-observation. This will help you as you progress to more advanced stages of self-development and understanding to eventually get to a place of effortless awareness and knowing what you truly are. A stage where we're no longer mindlessly reacting to the world or our old conditioning. Initially, in our inner journey, we were in the mode of just being passive observers in order to gather objective data about ourselves. We learned to become more conscious of ourselves in a holistic, integrated way. Later, we moved to being more conscious, active participants in our life, real actors in our life, where we know our roles in life and don't get lost in our story. We are vividly aware of ourselves doing whatever we may be doing as we are doing it. We become more conscious of ourselves and also of others. Later, we can move to a phase of where we are experimenting, consciously changing our behavior and going deeper into the spontaneous nature of reality. Being one with the spontaneous arising of life is the ultimate description of patience. Life may become easier for us, but this doesn't mean that it won't longer be challenging but we become more skillful in navigating life when we know who and what we are and the game we're playing. All right, guys, that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed today's quote. If you did, please help me out and hit the subscribe button and also the little notification bell. That way you know when I upload new content and share with anyone who may find my content valuable. I really appreciate you and trying to grow my little channel. So... Wherever you are in the world, I hope you're doing well. Take care, and, and until next time, peace.